What's going on guys, T Torres back here for another video. So in today's video, we do have an exciting video. We're going to be using uh, this awesome uh, AI uh, CarPlay box um, from CarLink. Um, I'll have a link down in the description to this box as well. This works with any uh, iPhone or Android operating system, whether you have wired CarPlay or wireless CarPlay. So what this box is gonna allow us to do, it's gonna allow us to run apps uh, on the car, like um, be able to watch Netflix, stopped you'll be able to watch your favorite streaming services like i said netflix youtube i've got youtube tv on there you can get hulu literally any streaming service that you use you can go into the google play store and download it i'm going to go into that in a little bit more in depth here in a minute but i just want to give you some knowledge about this one that i have it has eight gigs of ram and a hundred and twenty eight gig uh storage available on it there is yeah one two they have three different three different ones um now i'm going to be honest and upfront with you um this box does a lot more than what i probably know it could do it can have you can actually put a sim card in it for cellular data so for today's demonstration we're going to be using uh my girlfriend's car has you know 4g lte um hotspot in it so for instance whenever we go on road trips and uh, whenever we're at charging stations we can either use her car's wi-fi or we can use the hotspot um on our cell phone so uh, let me go ahead and unbox this thing <clears throat> and i'll show you guys uh let me set you guys up i'll show you guys exactly uh, what it looks like all right and like i said uh this box comes you can get this straight straight off amazon I will have a link down in the description. There are several different um, different ones you can get, like as far as RAM, RAM and storage goes. And then it comes with the, you get a USB-C and a USB uh, cable. So for today's video, we are going to be using the USB-C. And like I said, this is for anybody that has CarPlay wireless or a wired CarPlay uh, setup. So let me get all this going. Turn the air off, shut this door. Hopefully the music's not like blaring in here. Put that on me. Okay, let that load up. And then I'm gonna go down here in this little cubby area and plug in the USB-C. You'll have two lights. Two lights that come on up here to let you know that it's on and it's going to be transferring data and then all you got to do from here is literally you just go into your uh, settings to your Y or to your bluetooth and then it's called this auto kit t-box plus and then boom so it's automatically trying to connect we're going to hit continue it doesn't take very long at all to uh to connect all right so this is what i wanted to show you guys so this is the part that's cool so even though that it's we're using an iphone we're using the boxes carplay to to tether with the to tether with the uh, iphone so where's the tag on there's the home button all right so this is just like any other um android phone if you're familiar with it you have the google play store um i don't know if this box is connected to hang on let me see what wi-fi it's using oh, okay it's using my home wi-fi so let's go back to we'll use we'll use the cars sorry about that we'll use the cars uh the cars internet okay perfect all right so it says we're connected so so like i said so you can go into settings and uh, obviously this is the preferences that we're using to set up for the uh actual wi-fi but like i said this is a just brief overview of what this thing can do i've got the high definition video set up to the max max capable thing so here we go <clears throat> go literally to netflix hit me and I did find out and in, in one of the settings, you can get rid of this, you can get rid of that dot as well. Um, so just to show you, uh, hit play. 
Ivan Stepanov was abducted from his apartment in Pogorsky Hills. <laughs> so, I mean, like I said, you, it's awesome. It's amazing. All right, let's go back here. Show you some other stuff. Hit home. Go back here. So another thing that I like as well is my, where is it at? Ah, my YouTube TV so we can watch live live television. Like I said, the goal for us was to be able to, uh, we're going to use this for uh, when we're at charging stations. When we got to wait like maybe 20 or 30 minutes to uh, charge up, we'll be able to sit here, watch our favorite Netflix show or be able to watch, uh, be able to watch live TV like, uh, like you're seeing now. So let's see. You can't tell me that that's not cool. And like I said, this this works on all iPhone, Android. Um, it's got Waze already built in. It's got the VLC player. Uh, I downloaded Netflix. I download, downloaded YouTube TV. Um, obviously, it, it'll play this in a in a like a picture in picture category. Uh, of course, it's got YouTube. Like I said, this thing has. <laughs> This thing has so much stuff to it as well. And somebody on one of the forums was asking uh, if you get a phone call, you know, it'll stop playing the whatever you're watching and um, you'll be able to talk on the phone like you normally would with your CarPlay or uh, Android uh, Auto. Like I said, I, I don't know how Android Auto works, but like I said, this box takes it, uses our Apple CarPlay uh, signal and turns it into, you know, a pretty much a, another another operating system that that's that allows us to be able to do this. Um, like I said, that the car could be in drive. I don't I don't recommend you watching TV or any videos going down the road. Like I said, for our purpose, it's going to be for charging times when we're down in the car waiting waiting for the car to get <clears throat> charged up. We're going to be able to watch our our shows. Um, if you're interested in the box, I have a link down in the description. And if you guys have any more questions about the the actual box itself i can do some more research but like i said for our use it, it's just going to be um to be able to watch videos netflix youtube tv etc now this will work like i said if you have wired card play or wireless card play as well um usb and you have to have a usb or a usb c um a usb c uh plug-in in your car and then of course it comes with a comes, comes with a little user manual but Obviously, of course, I didn't read that at all, but I um, think this is going to be great for great for road tripping and um, be smart, be safe when you're using this thing. I know some people watching this are, are going to be watching stuff going down the road, but just be safe and use it as a passenger. Don't be watching TV as a driver watching it. But like I mentioned, thank you all so much for watching today's video. If you're interested in getting this box, um, we'll have a link down in the description. Like I said, there's several different options that you can pick from. Uh, hence the price for the RAM and the uh, bigger storage. Like I said, thank you all so much for watching today's video. Please hit that thumbs up button. You got to leave this video a big thumbs up. Um, hit that subscribe button, turn on your post notifications, and I'll catch y'all in the next video. Peace.